Welcome to second year students. Today, let us study the the chapter number two, that is the theory of consumer behavior. In theory of consumer behavior, today we shall study about the normal and inferior goods. Normal goods and inferior goods. Before we go into explain the normal rules and the inferior rules we have to understand the meaning of normal rules and inferior rules in the case of normal rules there is only the relation between income and demand and demand increases income increases demand decreases income decreases it is called as the normal rules normal rules those goods which or whose demand increases with increase in income and decrease with the income falls it is called as the normal rules normal rules those goods whose demand increases with increase or a rise in income and decrease the demand decreases with fall in income it is called as the normal goods once again those goods which demand increases with the rise in income and the demand decreases with fall in income it is called as the normal rules for example examples for normal rules is uh, we are daily eating these goods for example vegetables vegetables fruits and fruits these uh, vegetables fruits clothes we are using in daily life these are called as the normal goods normal goods but in case of demand the normal goods demand increases with increase or rise in income the normal goods demand decreases with fall in income that is called as the normal goods normal goods the examples of normal goods are vegetables fruits and clothes these are the normal goods you can do the number of examples for normal goods except these goods so these are called as the normal goods but in case of inferior goods in, in case of inferior goods there is a relation between income and demand the slope is vice versa in case of inferior goods but in case of normal goods the slope is direct as income increases demand also increases as income decreases demand also decreases in case of normal goods but in case of inferior goods the slope is vice versa the meaning of inferior goods it goes for which the demand decreases with the increase in income the demand decreases with increase in income of the consumer is called the inferior goods the consumer is called the inferior goods for example inferior goods like there are a couple of examples are given in the textbook there are many examples for example peel millet peel millet in the kannada it is sajji sajje it is called as a sajje in kannada and pinder millet it is called in kannada ragi and the box tail millet it is called in kannada tamedi and the cold millet it is called in arakki arakka 
these are the examples for the inferior goods but the relation is vice versa as the demand decreases income increases demand decreases income increases demand increases income falls it is vice versa in case of inferior goods this is the meaning of inferior goods and then normal goods normal goods and the inferior goods examples for normal goods vegetable fruits clothes examples for uh, inferior goods there are number of millets for example green millets finger millets box tail millets and the board millets except these things you can give number of inferior goods you have to collect and remember the whatever you use in daily life you have to answer and give the number of examples for inferior goods and the examples for normal goods so you have to write these examples in examinations the question will be what are the normal goods and the what are the inferior goods you the examples so you have to remember and keep remember and write in examinations well thank you